ho, ho, boys and girls! It's me, Santa Claus! <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. Okay, all right, now, calm down now. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Santa, shut up! Thank you. Now, unfortunately, uh, this Christmas Santa got in a bit of a trouble with uh, Mrs. Claus, and uh, let's just say Santa's gonna have to pay some uh, alimony now. But it's okay because uh, Santa Claus is uh, gonna get back on his feet with Sakura Santa. Um, Santa's gonna meet some fine ladies and do shit with. Okay, why does it have to be December? Well, that's because that's when Christmas is, silly. It isn't the night before Christmas yet. And all through the house, Santa was sobbing and drinking lots of alcohol because of what happened with Mrs. Claus. <laughs> but, but maybe you heard all the Christmas music that came early. Because there's nothing stirring. Not even a mouse. Oh, see, see? The, the game bit Santa to it. I got to be all alone at home. <laughs> it's lonely at the North Pole, boys and girls. <laughs> no, not like that movie. I mean, it's an apartment. Oh. Santa kind of likes his apartment. Uh, name's Koji. <laughs> no. Uh, Santa. Okay, I moved out to go to university. <laughs> it's pretty a decent university, but uh, about the best I could get. Feels like that's all I could get, though. Well, I mean, you know, all the, what Santa delivers the toys every Christmas. He doesn't get paid very much. No, no, Santa has a hard time making ends meet sometimes. <laughs> also, good way. Everything else hasn't gone Santa's way. I'm not very good at social skills, I guess. I mean, you know, I, I, I live at the North Pole with just elves. I, I don't know other humans. I mean, I, I try to introduce myself to people and I, I be nice to them. So I'm not sure why no one is even talking to me. Maybe it's bad luck or maybe I'm just boring. Who, who's calling Santa boring? Santa's not boring! Santa's loads of fun! Whatever. Stupid kitties. Maybe there's something more I could do to open up to people. I'm not really comfortable around town yet. It's still a strange place. I guess that's why I'm not getting into the Christmas spirit. Uh, when I think of Christmas, I always think of family and friends and... And, uh, and lots of eggnog. Yeah, so, you know Santa loves that eggnog. Yeah. And right now, Santa's all alone. <laughs> Maybe Santa's thinking about this too much. Normally, I, I don't dwell on this sort of thing. Still, it would be nice if I had some company. Now that Mrs. Claus left me, I guess it's hard to adjust to moving away from home. Classes have been okay. My grades are fine. So Santa, Santa decided to start majoring in, uh, in, uh, in advertising. You know, because you, you just you want to advertise the toys I give out, not just, not just make them, you know? I mean, no, they, they, that's what they do all the time on YouTube. But I keep hearing people say networking, 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 <laughs> Or at least that's that you should meet friends. Now this, this isn't exactly Christmassy. Yeah, come on, a Lord Paul looks better than this piece of crap. What, 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 what is this? Black coffee, and up the apartment, the home of the city outside the window. What's the point of a holiday if there's nothing to celebrate? Or no one to celebrate with. Wow, man, Santa. Santa's getting kind of depressed from all this bullshit. I think I should think of something to do. With university over for the winter break, I spent what feels like forever alone. Maybe I could try family. Uh, oh, see, 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 Santa's parent. <gasps> Santa has a brother. Oh yeah, Santa I forgot about his brother. Let's let's see what a good old uh, uh, Phil Claus. Hey, Phil! It's been a while since I talked to my brother, Phil. He's older by two years, and already left to go out in the world. We haven't spent Christmas together for the last two years. We had a Christmas tradition, I guess. We played Dungeon Rumbler 2! Oh yeah, that, that was loads of fun when I, I wanted to play Dungeon Rumbler 2. Probably don't have the old Arcadian Battle Station anymore, though. Wow, that's... I don't think Santa's ever given that out. I, I, I just make Xbox Ones and PS4s. Man, I'm gonna get with the times of those Arcadian Battle Stations! Maybe I could get one at, uh, usual, at a used game store, like GameStop, or Amazon. Yes, a a a Amazon's kind of running Santa out of business now. Uh, it's our Christmas tradition, after all. You're never too old to enjoy the game of Dungeon Rumbler 2. Let me just find his number. I think Christmas will be a lot of fun this year. Assuming I can call him, anyways. Well, why wouldn't I be able to call Phil? Uh, Alright, man. I guess we'll have to do it another year. I hope you have fun with your girlfriend's family. <gasps> Phil's got a girlfriend! Just... Just when Santa loses his wife! But... But Phil! Well, I'm blowing out the window. 
My brother's going overseas with his girlfriend this year. I don't talk to him much these days. Not really sure where they met. He sounded happy on the phone though, so... I'm happy to Santa's happy for Phil! Fuck you, Phil. Right, the two of them seem to be really getting along well together. He did sound like he really wanted to play Dungeon Rumble 2, though. I guess that's his... He... I guess that he's as nostalgic for that game as I am. Did I really use all up all my options already? I don't want to spend Christmas... Alone? <laughs> don't say it. The clock goes up another number, and then another number, and then another, and another, and another. another. This feels wrong. This isn't... Christmas. I remember... Being with my family. Having a good time. But right now! Nothing. Nah. Supper. What do I do now? What is Santa to do? I didn't have anything else in mind. Well, I could just spend Christmas alone. But... It, someone's gotta deliver the presents! Then it hits me. What that would really be like? Eating shrink wrap fruit cake. Staring out my window at all the people having fun. No. I won't let that happen. Santa is not gonna let the divorce get to him. I'm not gonna let those thoughts take over. No one wants to be around someone miserable. So I'll keep my head held high. And I'm not going to let this get to him, Santa. But I gotta admit, it would be nice to have someone with me this Christmas. I'm so used to, to Mrs. Claus. So, all right, so, so let's make this time. I could go out and volunteer for something or, or try to attend an event. Uh, anything would be better than just running away or Santa's apartment. Uh, I think I'll go out for a walk. It'll it'll help me think. And all the kiddies love to see Santa walking around outside. Uh, the shopping district downtown will have plenty of festive lights, I'm sure. Or maybe that will get me fully into the Christmas spirit. Oh, good. Oh, it's so nice. Look at this place. It's a pretty short walk to downtown from where Santa lives. Sure enough, it's pushing us ever. Christmas brings everyone out, I guess. Yeah, it brings everyone out. Even though there are more people here, though. I feel even more alone than before. Well, there's a crowd here, but it's not like I know any of them. Seems like walking is just making me think about this more. Maybe I forgot out of downtown, but where else would I go? It's not like anything is waiting for me back at my apartment. That piece of crap hole down down Ah, Yeah, yeah, feels like Santa's beard is kind of in his mouth a bit. Sorry. Okay. Well, well, where else can I sit down and just think to myself? Well, I could go to the park. I walk by a break in a small footpath. It leads it to the woods. A park, technically, but more like the edge of town. I don't know where it ends, though. Uh, it seems like I climbed some hills on the way. I mean, I don't have anything better to do, so I guess I'll go this way. Alright, I remember now. Oh, uh, there's supposed to be a shrine at the end of this path. Uh, maybe I can ask to get my fortune told. Oh, yeah! You know, I mean, Santa's not very, very, like, into Japanese customs, but, but Santa can get down with praying to a, a power that's higher than him. I mean, no power... <laughs> Santa's the highest form of life there is! I give presents for free, goddammit! Or I could ask for a blessing at the shrine, maybe wishes do come true. But, 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 but that requires an offering, and my pockets are... What, what does Santa have in his pockets? I don't know! I haven't got nothing in my pockets. Well, they aren't exactly jingling, but I managed to find some. I mean, it's just symbolic, right? Uh, it's the thought that counts. I don't normally go for this stuff, but uh, I would feel sort of reassuring, I guess. So maybe that's why we'll be worth visiting. Well, I don't lose anything if it doesn't work, right? Well, except for a few coins. But my spare change is better off keeping a roof over someone's head than just sending that, right? Yeah, yeah, you know. Oh. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, 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 dot. Dot, 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 dot. Dot. Okay. Oh, there's a shrine here. Kind of classy. Oh, I like this very Japanese samurai music. Kind of empty, though. Isn't there usually some kind of priest at these shrines? Well, I guess I can make an offering anyway. So, something's good at God making offerings. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I find the offering box. I throw the coins in. I don't know any uh, ritual, I guess. I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to summon any demons here. No rituals. I guess I can try praying, anyways. I just close my eyes, put my hands together. Hark! The Herald Angel sings. Glory to the newborn king. I'd like to have a friend to spend Christmas with. I... I have no idea if that'll actually help or not. But I feel a bit better, I guess. Yeah, Santa feels good. Even if spirits don't exist, doing this feels... comforting. And slightly gassy. Just then the priest calls to me. 
Hello! What brings you here, young man? Oh, I, I, I'm just making an offering. I'm Santa Claus. Don't you know who I am? Hmm, oh, good. It's nice to see young people around here again. I work hard to keep every day together, but not many come by. Well, the priest is an older man, and I can't help but notice that I gave him a really weird feminine voice. Are you okay? Uh, what do you mean? Oh, you mean my leg. Oh, I injured it a while ago. The doctor told me to rest, but I'm the only one here to take care of things. Also, so he's been pushing himself and making it worse. Uh, no, I, I, I'm not just going to let that, let that happen. I'm not just going to let that happen? I, that doesn't sound too right to Santa. I, th I think the game means happen. Yeah, happen. Poor guy needs a break. Uh, do you need help with anything around the shrine? My schedule isn't exactly crowded, so I have plenty of time to spare. Do you happen to have a cute daughter that I can talk to? Maybe I can give some presents? If I help out with things, maybe he'll finally have a chance to recover. Or, or I suppose I could use a help, yes. In fact, could you help shovel the snow off the path? Ah, uh, sure, I could do that for you. He flushed me a worn down smile. Oh, thank you. Oh, good, no, no problem. Well, that didn't take much time. The priest seemed very happy about it, too. Oh, thank you, young man. It would have taken twice the time. Oh, listen, I don't want you to hurt yourself or anything. I'll come by every few days. Santa's a carry, young man. Santa's not as strong as it used to be, though. Ah, uh, let me do the hard stuff, okay? Oh, you're too kind. I wish more people in your age were like you. Like me, huh? Oh, I don't really think I'm anything special. Being special isn't the point, Santa. Anyone can be kind, but not many actually choose to. And that makes you exceptional, anyways. Well, I guess you're right. Oh, anyway, I have other things to do. Ah, uh, sure, I'd love to- Oh, no, no, don't, don't worry about it. It's just an old man business. Nothing too hard. Santa's an old man, too! You've done more than enough. You do come again sometime, though. Oh, don't worry. I will. As he walks back into the shrine, uh, Santa feels a bit odd. W was this because of the wish I made? Or is he just really nice? It felt so easy to talk to him. Well, I'm happy I was able to do something. Anything for somebody. As I walk away from the shrine, I hear something rustling off the path. Huh? What? what was that? Santa going crazy again? Oh, probably just a raccoon. But I'm... But Santa's curious. I start pulling branches aside to see what's there. <gasps> oh, it's a big titty baby! Oh, Santa likes this! Oh, it's a girl with one, uh, one with eyes that seem to shine like stars. Oh, there's hearts! Not stars. Hearts are in those eyes. I haven't ever seen anyone who seems so happy. <laughs> oh, look at those titties! Oh, her smile seems so completely honest. But she has fox ears? Oh, so she's a, she's a, uh, what is it? Kisure. Yeah, Kisure, that's what they're called. Wait, whoa, that's a tail. You're so cute. Oh, oh that's, that's, that's not going to be her voice. I'll think of another. Excuse me? You're so mm -hmm. Okay. Give time to a second. Okay, Santa's going to go a little out of character for this voice, but I think he can pull it off. Mm -hmm. You're so nice to the old man. He's pretty lonely, you know. At least when I'm not around. What? What the hell was that? That sounded so real. Oh, my eyes wander from her brightly colored tail over to her bouncy titties. <laughs> hey, did you ever hear about the myth of Akatan? Eyes up! Oh, oh, sorry. I didn't mean to look at your big titties. <laughs> I'm just joking. Don't worry. I'm not going to sick any dogs on you. Actually, just the opposite. I kind of like you, so go ahead. Oh, okay. I'm not gonna see Gabe permission to stare at those titties. Oh, yes, that's, that's the good stuff. That's what Santa likes. That's what Santa wants this Christmas. Uh, so what's with the tail? Are you cosplaying or something? That's like everyone's kids cosplay. I'm a fuck spirit, so of course I have a tail. Is she serious? She really is a Kazune. It's my shrine. I'm the one you made one offering to. So I heard your wish, being a spirit at all. Oh, you're dead? Yeah, you're in luck. One time wish fulfillment service. I mean, the coins didn't impress me much, but what you did for the priest, real nice back there. So what goes around comes around. Oh, I never really thought about it that way. But Mrs. Claus never lets me do anything special with her. I, see, I thought you just did good things because it was the right thing to do. You should, but sometimes the world is listening and takes notice. I mean, you ought to have a friend for Christmas, right? Oh yeah, that's right. I definitely, I mean, you know, I wasn't very particular in the wishes on the but I definitely wanted a friend with really big titties. Ha 
Plus, you have you been moody? Oh yeah, I yeah, am. Seth has been through a bad divorce. Lots of, lots of eggnog. Back at his place. Could I be your friend? Oh hell yeah! Her ears perk up at the point, illustrating her excitement. You'd, you'd be Santa's friend? Why wouldn't I be? Well, Santa's not exactly the best in shape. He's kind of fat these days. Uh, I don't know if she's for real or not, or if she's really a fox bear like she says she is. Though, I'm not really sure I mind one way or another. If she's here, of course I'm going to visit the shrine. Sure, I'd like to be your friend. And I would love to be yours. Hooray, we're friends with... My name is Akina. Okay, well, Akina, it's been lots of fun, and this has been a really great Christmas so far. I think things are turning around for Santa, so thank you guys so much for watching Santa play Sakura Sunday. I mean, this. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching Santa play Sakura Santa. Here comes more content later on in the future, and Santa, we'll see you guys next time. Ho ho, bye bye. <laughs>